Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Aries? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. How's everyone doing? Thank you. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening. My returning subscribers, my new subscribers, thank you. You are welcome. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for coming to my channel. It means a lot to me. Okay. And um, I just want to say happy holidays. I hope everyone is staying safe. To my viewers, cross watchers, you are welcome as well. Okay. Thank you. So I'm going to pull two energy cards and let's see what the energy is for you. All right. Let's see. Thank you, Spirit. Holy Spirit. White light. Two energy cards for Aries. This is for Aries. Okay, Aries. Here we go. Two cards for Aries. Two cards for Aries, Spirit. Okay. I thought I took that out, but I didn't. Okay. I don't do the chakras. Pull one more. I'm learning more about the chakras, so that's why I take them out. All right, Aries. So, your first card of the spirit that I have, your your energy, is um, blossoming abundance. And I also have attachment as well in your energy. So we have blossom abundance, and we have we have uh, attachment. Okay. So let's find out, Spirit, Holy Spirit. This is for Aries. Tell me what you need for me to know about Aries. What is the message for Aries, Spirit? Thank you, Spirit. Holy Spirit, white light, I ask you to protect me from any negative energy. Thank you, Spirit. All right, Spirit. All right. Aries, we have the hangman. We have it in reverse. That lets me know this. A lot of you have control. A lot of you are really stabled. You have control. You are, you're not overthinking anything. You know your mind, your light bulb is on, and you are definitely, you're definitely aware of a lot of things. You know, you are, you, you, you are in control. You're in control. And that is great. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. All right, Aries. What I like, I said before, um, I see that you're in control of your thoughts. You're in control of how you feel, what what you're thinking about, and I feel as though for a lot of you, you're really in control of your independence. Okay. I also get the energy that a lot of you are in fear. You're holding yourself back. You're very cold hearted right now, um, and it may be. From lack of, you know, lack of, you just not wanting to, I know it sounds, you know, a little different because the hangman is in the upright, which tells me that uh, you know exactly what you are doing. You know exactly uh, how you're feeling right now. And right now you're feeling very cold. You're feeling uh, the lack of enthusiasm. You, you're really feeling, you know, restricted. You're holding yourself back. Um, I really feel like this is for, for a lot of single, a, a lot of you that are single. You, you've been sitting, you've been waiting, you've been wishing for something. You have the nine of cups, which tells me you have been praying. You've been sitting, waiting. But I also feel as though that a lot of you are very cold. You're holding yourself back. You have the lack of interest. Um, and I feel as though that you have a lack, a lack of interest of wanting to date again, wanting to get to know someone, even though you prayed about it and it has been granted to you, Aries. But I feel as though that a lot of you are really holding yourself back. Um, right now, you're very cold. You have the queen of cups in reverse. You're very cold. Um, you, you don't have any enthusiasm. Um, but, you know, at the same time, I see uh, it's a lot of, of blossom and abundance around you. But I feel as though this attachment, this cold attachment that you have that's going on within yourself, there's a lot of cold attachments. Um, maybe from a previous relationship, you know, this it's almost like I feel the energy of bitterness. 
I, I feel as though that uh, 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 quite a few of you are bitter. You're very, you're very um, cold. You're very cold. You you really don't have any ambition. You like the lack of. You don't want to collaborate with anyone. You don't want to deal with anyone. Thank you, Spirit. Uh, you're reframing yourself back. Um, you, you, you've been sitting, hoping, praying. Uh, I really think that a lot of you are still holding on to some attachments from your past. You're holding on to some bitterness. And um, until you let go of that bitterness, you can't get this blossom in abundance. I really feel like a lot of you are stuck. You just like, you know, you have the hangman, you have it upright. You're standing there, but it's like you're not bulging. It's like you're you just like, you know what? You you are who you are. And it's fine, but at the same time in order to get this blossom and abundance, Aries, a lot of you have to come out of that that coldness, that bitterness to uh, that attachment for what someone has done to you, what your past relationship has done to you. Because I see a lot of coldness, a lot of lack of, a lot of not interested, a lot of holding yourself back. You're just, you're single and you're bitter. I'm sorry, but this is how the cars are, you know, this is what the cars is saying. This may not be for all of you. But for for a quite few of you, you're single, but you're just still holding on to attachments that you're still bitter about. That's why you can't move forward, because you're still thinking about what that person done. You're still thinking about what that person done to you. Okay, Aries? So you have to let go of this bitterness in order to get this blossom of abundance that's trying to reach your life. It's really trying to get there. And, and, and people are like, oh, well, I've been waiting. Well, I've been. Well, you know what? Until you raise your vibration, you will see different results. Until you raise your vibration, you will see different um, results. Right now, I see a lot of single, a lot of you that are single, you are definitely um Still linked, still thinking about the attachment you had. You're definitely cold. You're bitter. You're bitter. And don't shoot the messenger. I'm just relaying the message. This is what Spirit is saying. This is how the cards come out. A lot of you need to let go of the bitterness so that you can go into your full blossoming of abundance. Okay? I love y'all. I'm not trying to be, I'm not being mean. I'm just reading the cards. But sometimes we have to look at ourselves so that whatever we've been through won't hold us back. Won't hold us back for what we deserve to have in our life. And that's abundance in all areas of our life. And a lot of you have to let go of this attachment. It's just saying it right here, okay? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Aries, until next time.